Sagittarius Sun, Scorpio Venus. I like to call this placement a wild secret. Wild secret as in you have the outgoing, adventurous, philosophical, spiritual Sagittarius person. But their Venus is in the sign of Scorpio. Emotional, very attached, fixed, stubborn, secretive, mysterious, alluring, sexual, with the Sagittarius sun. The sun, your ego, what you put off into the world. Your Venus, your love style, what attracts you, how you attract, beauty, money, pleasure, friendship. You have this extravagant sign of Sagittarius, big, broad, spontaneous person. But with the Venus in Scorpio, all of these things about the Sagittarius that are common, all of the personality traits of the Sagittarius has to slowly be revealed. And when I say slowly be revealed, I mean slowly revealed to the Sagittarius person. You see, a Sagittarius, whenever a person has a son in Sagittarius, one of the ultimate goals of their lives, even when they don't even realize it, is to figure out who they are. So when I think of the Sagittarius sun with the Venus Scorpio placement. The Sagittarius's personality is often hidden from themselves until they have experiences, until they are able to go on adventures on their own and learn through their own personal experiences. The Sagittarius in general is a sign that loves experiences experiences are very sentimental to a Sagittarius person whether male or female the Sagittarius learns the most through its own experiences the Sagittarius is a very detached sign okay the Sagittarius is naturally detached and so throughout the life of a Sagittarius Sun Venus Scorpio person the Sagittarius has to learn to attach itself to certain things which creates themselves so the Sagittarius Sun and Venus and Scorpio person is probably going to go through their early childhood knowing everything as in they are children but even as children they are able to sense everything that is taking place around them because Scorpio Scorpio is about the deep the deep emotional stuff. Scorpio is an emotional genius. Anytime you have a Scorpio placement, wherever that placement is, it is going to be very emotionally intelligent, but they will have a hard time knowing exactly what these emotions are and their purpose. So having a Sagittarius sun with the Venus and Scorpio, this is going to be a very secretive placement secretive yet open secretive yet loud secretive yet adventurous the sagittarius sun person with the venus and scorpio will have a very hard time expressing who they really are for a long time until they are adults until they have gained a lot of personal knowledge through their experiences this is where the wisdom comes from with this placement. Usually through more so painful experiences when it comes to money. Painful experiences when it comes to love. Painful experiences when it comes to their creativity. 
So the Sagittarius sun, as they age, the Sagittarius sun is able to peel back all of these layers of the Scorpio energy through their spontaneity, through their knowledge, through their search for knowledge, through their spiritual awakenings. Everyone else around the Sagittarius sun and the Venus and Scorpio person will know exactly who the Sagittarius sun and Venus and Scorpio person is on the outside. They will know, but the Sagittarius sun, Venus and Scorpio person won't quite grasp what others know until later on. The Sagittarius Sun, Venus, and Scorpio person will go years diving into different projects, getting in and out of different relationships until it feels correct. The Sagittarius Sun, Venus, and Scorpio person can get very comfortable in relationships and in friendships. And although they are very emotional and, un and attached when it comes to love and uh, their relationships and their money and careers that can easily detach with the strength of a Sagittarius sun. And these detachments are very painful for someone with this placement because the sun is your ego. Venus is what attracts you, what you're attracted to, how you attract things. So it is very painful for the Sagittarius sun to let go of what feels right inside. Even if what feels right inside has some painful things to go along with it. The Sagittarius sun is a very optimistic, deep and optimistic with the Venus and Scorpio placement. So having a deep and optimistic way, the Sagittarius sun is able to endure very painful experiences. And seemingly the Sagittarius sun will move on in life without any scratches or any burns. Because with the Sagittarius sun, the Sagittarius sun is so optimistic that they are willing to destroy any and everything that causes them pain, even if they love it dearly. And this is the scary side of the detachment of the Sagittarius sign in general. The Sagittarius sun and the, with the Scorpio Venus is very powerful. They can rebuild anything that they put their minds to. They can rebuild anything that they feel in, they, in their heart that they can. The Sagittarius sun, Venus and Scorpio person may not really realize who they are until later on in life. And when they do, it's a very, very moving experience for the Sagittarius sun with the Venus and Scorpio. When the Sagittarius sun, Venus and Scorpio person peels back enough layers and they can finally see themselves. This is when the Sagittarius sun will feel comfortable and confident in expressing their more creative side when it comes to the arts, in their friendships and relationships, they are more open to love. And they finally understand it. The more the Sagittarius sun, Venus and Scorpio understands the world around them, the more they understand themselves. This is a very transformative placement to have because not only will the Scorpio energy provide crazy transformation for, for this placement, but coupled with the Sagittarius sun's fire, it will be phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal and life changing for not only the Sagittarius sun, Venus and Scorpio person, but for anyone in which they spend their time with. The Sagittarius sun, Venus and Scorpio person is going to be a deep thinker. 
a lot of times their imagination can get the best of them and they can really dive head first into projects that they have no clue on how they're going to finish. Because the Sagittarius sun is very optimistic. They're very philosophical. They aren't very good with the details. And a lot of times the Sagittarius sun misses out on all the details and rushes straight, straight head first into the bigger picture. Oh, oh, and when you have a Venus and Scorpio here, it just feeds the Sagittarius energy because Scorpio is very mysterious. Scorpio is trying to figure out its place. It's trying to figure out its emotions. So with a big thinker leaving out the details and with a very emotional sign trying to figure them all out, you can imagine the space left here in which the Sagittarius often forgets. And that is the details on how they're going to get to the finish line. Until the Sagittarius sun, Venus and Scorpio person peels back those layers and realize the person that they are through their spiritual awakenings, through their experiences, through their adventures and explorations, and through their, their artistic uh, creativity, through them being creative, through them being open-minded, they're able to peel back those layers and finally fill in those details in order to finish their goals and reach their goals and see their highest potential. Sagittarius, Sun, Scorpio, Venus. You want to express all of the things that you feel, but you can't because you're not comfortable enough you're not confident enough in that until you have certain experiences. So a lot of times you can feel boggled down with your emotions and your thoughts. You can be confused about your own identity. So allow yourself to have these experiences. Allow yourself to step out of the box so that you can truly see who you are as an individual. Because as a Sagittarius son, your individuality is very important to you. And so if you are having any difficulty understanding who you are, it's probably because you're not allowing yourself to have enough experiences. And experiences can be mind experiences. Maybe you're not pushing yourself to learn more. Because Sagittarius, you have to learn more. Scorpio is okay being comfortable. It's, it's fixed. But with the Sagittarius sun, it is like you have this person behind you that's pushing you and pushing you and pushing you to get to know yourself, the world around you, and the people around you. And that's Sagittarius. That's Sagittarius. Because you're going to be able to channel your emotions better with your experiences. You know the saying, there's never a right time. The right time is now. It's never really a right time. The right time is now. You can be a big procrastinator because you're afraid of the dark. You live in the dark, but you're afraid of the dark with this Venus and Scorpio placement. Isn't it crazy that you're afraid of the very thing that you know so well? So don't be afraid to push things to the limit when it comes to learning about who you are. To learning about others, being open to learning about others. Because you can be very stubborn, you're very fixed, Scorpio Venus but you're also very open, Sagittarius Sun. This openness allows you to understand your fixed nature. You guys, this is P, the Sagittarian Goddess. I hope you all enjoyed this video on the Sagittarius Sun with the Venus and Scorpio placement. And this is just a general reading on this placement. But 
this is my take on it with from a person that has this placement and if you do have this placement leave me a comment down below and let me know how it resonated with you because that will also help me because i i, I am i am self-taught in this area so it really helps me to know how this resonates with you all so i will see you all in the next video